I'm just so confused. I'm very confused. I'm kind of confused. I don't know what's going on. I'm kind of confused. I'm confused again. I'm still confused. Hey guys, it's Maddie, and welcome back to another video on my YouTube channel. If you don't know who I am, hi, my name is Madison, and I do a lot of reading vlogs. Like, 2020 was, like, my year of reading vlogs. I did a lot in 2020, and I've only done one so far this year. So here we are, we're doing a reading vlog on a book. Like, this is, like, the most popular book on BookTube, and that's Illuminae by Amy Kaufman and Jay Kristoff. This is a library copy, so that's why it's, like, shiny and, like, it crinkly it's because it's a library copy because I didn't want to buy this book because I wanted if I want if, if I want to buy this book I want to make sure I like it because I don't really like sci-fi and this book is sci-fi and I don't like sci-fi because I've never read a lot of sci-fi I don't read a lot of sci-fi so I didn't want to buy this book in case I didn't like it and then just have it sit on my shelf and like be a waste of money because like mm. anyway so basically I'm starting this book I started this book like Friday, I read two pages of it, and I didn't think it was worthy of that, like me telling you what it was about. So today I started it, and um, it's a pretty quick read, which like makes sense. It's a mixed media format, so like you have like like text messages in here and blocks of font, which are in black paper. Don't ask me why. I'm almost at the page. I'm not at the page yet, but I'm almost there. So I'm currently on page 73, and it's like a. It's an email, there's like websites in here, I don't know. It's a mixed media format book. I came into this high, this book with high hopes um, because A, not only is, the, is it like one of the most popular books on the on BookTube, but it's also one of Kayla, aka Book uh, Books and Lala's favorite books of last year. And I love Kayla. I, I trust her opinion so much too. And so I really came into this book with high hopes. And the only thing I have to say for it right now is I'm very confused. I don't know. I'm just so confused. I think I'm addicted and I don't know why. It's a good book. I'm just really confused. I don't really know, but it's a good book and I can't stop reading it. Oh, I'm addicted. I'm addicted and I don't know why. They killed James, and I'm not okay! I'm reading. Huh. Well, this is a reading vlog, so obviously you know that. I am currently on page 279 of this book, and I'm kind of confused, but like, that's kind of just the motto of this entire reading vlog. I'm confused, but okay. Like, I don't know what's going on, but this is a really good book, so yeah. I don't know what's going on! I'm confused. This whole thing and this whole page, these whole pages in Aiden's point of view, I don't know what the heck is going on and that's this entire video. I don't know, but I'm enjoying the book and I don't want to stop, but I have to stop, so I don't know what to do. More data from the Aiden Cord. This is where things start to get dot 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 complicated. I'm sorry, but when was anything involving Aiden not complicated? Oh my god! Um, that was my general reaction. I had to remake it, um, because I wasn't filming on page 294. By the way, there's spoilers in this. I never, I always forget to say that it's going to be spoilers in my reading vlogs because I just can't not do that. Um, he opened the doors to Hangar Bay 4. Um, and I don't know what to say. I mean, like, supposedly Katie's mother's in there. Um, but, like, what if McNulty? What if he ain't dead? He's probably dead. But, like, what if he ain't? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Hello, my friends. Um, it's 11.25. I always seem to update when it's literally almost midnight and I should be in bed. Um, but hey. <laughs> anyway, so this is the book we're reading. Okay, you know this. You're probably wondering, what are your opinions? I'm on page 440. I stopped at the security because it's absolutely my least favorite part of this entire book. Well, okay. Like, the, the websites 
I really don't like, but we haven't had one of those in like 400 pages, so I'm okay. My second least favorite thing to read in this book is the transcripts of the like video cameras because obviously, obviously it's a book so you can't like see a video of what's going on so it's what's happening like through the video camera is like being transcribed if that's the right word by somebody who I don't know Aiden I don't know um I posted something on my uh, Goodreads. On my Goodreads, I posted a update on, like, this book. You know, 440 pages out of 602. Even though this says 559, but... 500... 599. Huh. <laughs> Basically, I said, I feel like if you took all the romantic relations out of the song I Hope You're Happy Now by Carly Pierce and Lee Bryce and Lee Bryce, the song would fit perfectly for the situation. Also, how dare Aiden do that to E? So I filmed some clips on my phone. I don't think we're going to go in, but you know, it was in that it was shown spoilers that Aiden, you know, that was acting as E, and that Ezra died. And I just want to say, no, um. I don't like that because I like Ezra and I didn't want it to happen, but it happened. Am I supposed to root for Aiden now? I know there's two more books in this series. I don't know what they're going to involve, like different characters? I have no idea. Anyway, I'm on page 440 of this book. It's okay. Um, I don't think it's going to be five stars. Okay. I'm just really confused with like what's going on. I know that Katie is trying to fix Aiden now, but like I thought that Katie was a robot because like things are pointing to that she's like an AI or something like Aiden, just like in a human body. So I thought that, but <laughs> she's not. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> that's my update. I'll see you guys when I finish the book, probably. Hi, so I'm on page 584 and I'm kind of confused. I feel like that's all this vlog needs to be. Five seconds or just a compilation of me saying I'm confused because I'm very confused. So like, they're saying when the Lincoln was first vanquished at Carenza, Alexander fled, counting her dead. Who's her? It also says the second time the Lincoln was vanquished, Ezra Mason landed in the Alexander Hangar Bay to, sh to the shouts and jeers of his fellows. Wait, maybe if I just kept reading, I wouldn't have been so confused. I'm confused again. Wow, I'm surprised. Um, well, I should probably continue reading before I say I'm confused again. You neglected to mention my son is alive. Who's your son? Sign to you. Wait! Wait! Son! Leanne is his mother! I'm still confused. So, uh, he's not dead. He's not dead. But, like, Ezra's not dead, thank God, because he's the best character of this entire series. I'm just saying. He's the best character, so thankfully he's not dead. I, I, I liked it. Um, I'm just saying, this was really cute. Okay, well, that's a weird thing to say at the end of a book that just involved a mass murdering thing. But, like, this was really cute. Look at that. Oh, that's adorable. I really liked this book. I really did. I'm not going to give it five stars because, my God, I was, like, confused during the, well, the entire thing. But, like, I really liked it. I'm glad Ezra's not dead. He's the best character. Um, I liked it, as I've said. Um, I'm going to set you up, like, properly. And then, because um, I also want to film, I want to film my, like, wrap-up thingy. So, just hold on a second. So, it is 6 o'clock. Well, actually, it's 5.55. Um, and it is the 23rd of February, and I finished this book today, just now. I have opinions, I have feelings. You've, if you've watched the entire vlog, which obviously you have if you got to this point, I assume you have, then you know that my main 
thing with this book is what the heck happened, and I'm so confused. Um, I'm gonna give it four stars, just a nice even four stars. Um, I did like it, I did enjoy it, um, but I'm so glad that Ezra is not dead, because if he was, like, mm, I'm just, mm, so happy. Also, I don't know what happened at the end. Like, if, if you've read this book, can you please explain to me the ending of this book? Because I don't know how it ended. I should see if Books and Lala's reading vlog had spoilers at the end of it. Because I didn't want to, like, watch it because I wanted you to read the book. So I didn't want to watch the entire video because I don't want spoilers. But now that I've finished it, I can, I don't, maybe I should watch a spoilery video on this book. Because then, okay, it's coming along, it's coming along. But yes, I give this book four stars. I really liked it. My favorite character is Ezra. I'm so glad he's not dead. I do plan on reading the sequel. Um, because honestly, this book took me by surprise because I came into it and I was like, it might get three stars, okay? I was like, it might get a three, and that would be, like, the highest it could possibly get for me, right? Because I've never read a sci-fi book. Well, okay. This is, like, a light sci-fi, and I DNF'd it, and then I have Zenith on my shelf, which I've got to page 30 of, which I don't know if that's just the book as a thing in general, and not just, not the genre, not the genre, but just, like, a book thing. Because, yeah, it's Zenith. Anyway, so I did go into this book with very low hopes, and I think I should do that. I think I should go into a book thinking, like, God, I'm not going to like this book. Because I was blown away. Well, literally and figuratively, because literally I was blown away from the entire plot of this book. Because I don't know what happened. But I was blown away by how good it was. And I really like it. And I do want to get my own copy. And I want to have the entire series. And I want to read the second one right now. Because hopefully in the second one it will tell me what happened. Greatly appreciated if you guys did that. But, um, yeah. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys want to see me do a reading vlog on the second one, you should tell me in the comment section. I think I'm going to have comments on for this video. Like, I'm going to put it to where this is not made for kids, just so I have comments. So, if you guys want to comment, um, like, anything I, what I just said. If you guys want to comment the ending, like, Put like spoilers, then like make it to where like you have to click read more to have like to see what happened. If someone can explain to me the ending of this book, like the Leanne situation, whatever, greatly appreciated. And if you guys want me to read the second one and like vlog it, I'm gonna read the second one. But if you want me to vlog my experience reading it, you should tell me as well because I will do it. I want to read the second one. I can't wait to read the second one. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give a big fat thumbs up and subscribe down below because if you're not already, because I post videos every single Monday. And so, I will see you guys all next Monday. Bye. And hey, don't forget, I'm still a freaky Bye. Cause all of the birds know that I'm almost dead. I'm barely breathing. Let me in peace.